Welcome back to my French Corner. So today I'm going to take you along with me for a week from Monday to Friday and I'm going to show you like a what I eat in a week in France. I thought it could be fun to show you what we eat on a daily basis in my family, so in French family, an average French family I guess. And yeah, just show you my lunch and my dinners every day for like from Monday to Friday. I thought it could be fun, so I hope you guys are going to enjoy it and let's eat some French food. 11.30 so I'm going to start cooking for lunch so right now I'm doing the rice so I'm kind of rinsing it out and then I'm going to put some new fresh water and I'm going to use the cuisinari I don't know how you call it in English but it is a cuisinari which is so nice you just have to put the rice and the water in there and then it's done so it's super nice so I use that and then we're going to eat it with this quenelle and then we have some sauce also I need to get ready Préparation. Immerger totalement dans une casserole adaptée les quenelles, chauffer à feu moyen jusqu'à eau frémissante. Lorsque les quenelles remontent à la surface, comptez 6 à 8 minutes de cuisson. Égouttez-les et disposez-les dans un plat chaud si possible. Nappez-les de notre sauce nantua, which is this sauce. And then, what do we have to do next? Servez sans attendre et savourer. Ok, so let's do that. All the quenelle in the casserole and then I just put light fire and so we're waiting so the water is supposed to start boiling and then the quenelle are supposed to come back to the surface so we're waiting for that so if you don't know what quenelle are which was the thing I'm cooking right now it's basically like a pretty typical meal for the east of France especially so basically it's kind of like a mixture of breadcrumbs and flour and sometimes it has other flavors like right now it is like quenelle with fish so you have fish in it as well So now I need to do this sauce so it says faire chauffer à feu doux dans une casserole agitée avec un fouet Now I'm making the sauce So I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing <laughs> So it says to kind of move it around, so that's what I'm doing. Rice is done. My mom actually did two uh, other boulangerie by car and she found one that was open, so we got some bread for lunch. Tonight we're making some flamen kusha and it's kind of pretty typical also from France, especially from the east of France again, and more so like Alsace and stuff like that. So on Tuesday we actually went to Paris because it was Chinese New Year so we wanted to walk around and see the parade and so we decided to also go to eat some Vietnamese banh mi at a food spot we love and actually made a vlog about it so if you're interested it's my last video. So first I took a banh bao and I took one with caramelized pork so I'm going to eat that I'm so excited I love the texture and it's still warm so let's eat that. So that's what it looks like in the inside. And it's very, very soft and kind of gooey, which is really nice. So for dinner actually my mom tried a pad thai recipe from like a book we have, it's like easy quick recipes to make and it actually did not turn out very good. <laughs> So on Wednesday for lunch we just had leftovers so I got the sausage, a piece of meat, some potatoes and green beans. So then for dessert we got some cannelli at the boulangerie, it's like a little dessert from the south of France, it's so freaking good, if you can try it out. And so we got that and then we made some tea to go with it. 
So for dinner, I actually also ate some leftovers from the tarte flambe you saw earlier. So for lunch today, my mom cooked some like gratin and I'm not sure exactly what it is inside. I think it's potatoes and fish. I'm not sure. It does look good. I don't know if I will like it. I don't think I ever tried this one before, so let's try it. So I decided to kind of be a cash potato. Uh, I'm home by myself today, so I just brought my food on a plateau and then I got a little fruit for dessert and then I was going to watch some Netflix. I'm actually watching All of Us Are Dead right now. I just watched one episode, so I wanted to continue watching it. So I just came back from the doctor and so it's kind of late already, it's like 2 o'clock so I'm super hungry. So I didn't feel like cooking so I got a pasta box. So it's not healthy, it's not very good for you but sometimes you just go to get some uh, kind of almost fast food just because you don't feel like cooking, you know. So yeah, I'm just going to eat that and maybe I will eat an apple or something for dessert. 